Hi everyone, this is Jenny Streeby with Confessions of a Hairstylist, and I couldn't be more excited because I have my girl here, Claire, with Vanity Claire. You girls have to check her out because she's a fashion blogger that is fabulous. I'm gonna go ahead and put her link below. So what we decided to do today, so she wanted to do something kind of fishtail braid um, and boho related, so to make a fun, unique uh, spin on the fishtail braid, we decided to do a fishtail bubble look. So it's gonna be off to the side, it's very unusual, but it's definitely gonna to help turn heads. So let's go ahead and get started. All right, so starting off, what I went ahead and did is just like a small U section. And I did a little bit of off center. So about um, eyebrow up and then to the tip of the eyebrow on this side. So that's gonna be our first section and we're gonna move the hair going to the right. So all we're gonna do is pull it back and start a simple fishtail braiding technique. So when we do that, all you want to do is split the hair in half. I'm not using a lot of tension. I'm taking a small piece of hair from the right and going up and over to the left. Now taking a small piece of hair from the left going up and over to the right. I'm taking small sections because it's going to help give it a more dramatic fishtail braid. And we're just going to simply do right to left. Now that we've done a fishtail braid about two to three inches um, long, I'm gonna go ahead and pancake this braid out. And I'm simply gonna do this by pinch and pulling each section of hair. This is gonna create a really thick looking fishtail braid. So now we wanna create that bubble feel. So what we're gonna do is take some hair on the right side and the left side and we're gonna connect it with an elastic underneath that fishtail. Now before moving on, we're gonna actually hide the elastic band. That's gonna help give it a more polished feel. So we're taking a small section of hair from underneath and simply just wrapping it around our elastic band. Then leaving a couple inches away from the very ends and putting a bobby pin in there and just pushing it up into the uh, fishtail braid to hold it into place. All right, so now that we have our first bubble, now we're gonna go ahead and continue to do another fishtail braid a few inches down. So again, just splitting the hair in half, taking a small piece of hair from that right side, crossing it up and over to our left, and then taking a small piece of hair from the left side, crossing it up and over to our right. We're just gonna continue this until we get two to three inches down. So now that we've reached a couple inches, I'm gonna pinch the hair and I'm gonna pinch and pull the fishtail braid out to create a fuller looking fishtail braid. All right, so I have went ahead and secured the ends with an elastic. Now we're gonna pull the rest of the hair together and do another elastic, creating a ponytail. And we're just gonna continue doing our fishtail um, braid a few inches down, securing it with elastic as we go and pancake it out. Taking a small piece of hair from underneath wrapping it around our elastic. Again, taking a bobby pin and pushing it through up into the hairstyle so you can't see it. So now I'm just continuing a fishtail braid a couple inches down, then I'm gonna secure it with an elastic and create our bubble effect. And securing the ends with an elastic. All right, so now I went ahead and created our last um, loop here. I'm gonna go ahead and spray it with a little bit of Label M hairspray. Then I wanna pull a little bit of hair out because we want that softer kind of boho feel. So all the loose bits that are around her face that are gonna naturally kind of fall out through the day, we wanna kind of yank on and pull them out and just kind of rough up the texture. It's always around the temples if there's a few little baby hairs. All right, so there you guys have it, a gorgeous, fun, 
bubbled fishtail braid that's off to the side. It's definitely um, one of those statement braids. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. Feel free to check me out on Instagram at the Confessions of a Hairstyles. Check out Claire at Vanity Claire on Instagram, and I'll see you guys soon.